Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I will talk about limit. So we can apply the formula in here. So capital A that is about this one. Now we need to transform this one in here and we got like this so I will put the limit goal here so we need to focus on this one now we have the second formula in here So capital A that is about this one, capital B that is about this one. So I will put one over and go on here. Next. We have the next one. So we need to transform this one into this one. So capital A that is about this one, capital B that is about this one, and now we have like this next we can do about factorization by 4 to the power of n Similar for number 6 to the power over of n. So we have the next formula in here. That is about f and 8 plus f and b so this is about capital a this is about capital b so now we have like this so the next one we can do similar So, for the next one, this one, that is about n, f, n number 4. This one we have n, f, n number 6. So, n and n, we can do about factorization. So n divided by n, we got this one. So we just have this one left. So 
So when n approaches to positive infinity, number 2 is smaller than number 4. So when n go to positive infinity, this one you got number 0. Similar this one you got number 0. Fn number 1 minus Fn number 1. Fn number 1 you got number 0. This one you got number 0. So everything in here you got number 0. 0 divided by positive infinity you got 0. So the final answer we have this one. And this one we can put like this. That is about 4 over number 6. So we can put 2 over 3. And now we put this one go back in here. And that's the, the value of this limit. And then we simplify and we got 2 over 3. This is the end. Thank you for watching.